Hi everyone, in front of me I've got a Motorola Edge 60 Fusion and let me show with you how to change the three buttons navigation into the gestures in this device. So let's begin with opening the settings and here we have to scroll and find the gestures. So let's tap on it. Then we have to tap on system navigation and as you can see uh, here we've got the gesture navigation so the option we're looking for. Before we will set it, as you can see here we've got this um, settings icon next to the three button navigation which means that you can for example change the button order so we can reorder the back button and the recent just by tapping on the switcher here but let me go back and let's set a gesture navigation let's tap on this option and as you can see instead of the three buttons we've got this line which is responsible for some gestures we can of course enter the settings and uh, we can decide whether we want to swipe for the assistant uh, we can show or hide the navigation bar uh, however, the circle to search is uh, enabled, so it has to be turned on. If you will turn it off, then you will be able to hide the, uh, the bar. Uh, and here you've got the back gesture sensitivity. And to be honest, I highly recommend to get back to this option after a while of using the gesture. So you will be able to decide whether you need the sensitivity to be higher or lower uh, just by using it. All right, uh, so now a quick tutorial of how to use the gestures. So in order to get back to the previous uh, page, just like by using the back button, you have to swipe your finger from the side to the center. And you can see that we've got this arrow, so we can release the finger and we just go back. And a quick disclaimer, as you can see here, we've got the circle to search so we can turn it off and then you will be able to hide the, uh, the, the bar. Uh, so the back button or back gesture actually works the same from the right side. If you'd like to get back directly to the home page, swipe your finger from the bottom to the center and make sure that this motion is quick and short. So something like that. And if you'd like to open the recent or repeat the gesture, so from the bottom to the center, however, elongate it a little bit and hold your finger somewhere here. Something like that. And here we've got the recent. All right. So that'll be all. Thank you so much for watching. Please hit the subscribe button and leave the thumbs up.